Welcome to another video. On uh, this video, I'll be showing how you can start your own mobile site in a few steps. Uh, if you Google around for the mobile frameworks, you might see a bunch of uh, other um, frame frameworks from JavaScript, and there's many. On this video, we're going to be using jQuery Mobile. So if you go to jQueryMobile.com, uh, the first thing you'll see is all of this um, device support for this uh, JavaScript library. So how do I get started? So the easiest way of doing this is you go to download. And if you scroll down, you see the latest version stable 1.2.0. And then you'll see this uh, copy and paste snippet. So what, that's what you need to do. Copy and paste this, guys, these three lines. And you open your Visual Studio. New project. We're going to do an MVC page. I'm going to use the three. And I'm going to go. Okay, then we're gonna select the Razer Internet application and just hit okay. Just this guy. Click okay. So that's it. So this guy should work right away. So okay, it's working. Like it's planned. Now we're gonna do a mobile version. So what I do, the easiest way that I found is go to your share, and what I'm gonna do is just add a view, and this one I'm gonna call it mobile uh, layout, and I'm not gonna use a master page just like that. Click add. And it should give us a plain HTML page. So now this is where we paste these values into this layout. So we go on the head section and paste this section. So now to see if this is working, we're going to remove this div and just say mobile master. Just like that. To get to this, we're gonna go ahead in to the home controller, and we're gonna make a, a index for the for the mobile. So action result. I'm gonna call it mobile index, and then return the view. So now we just right click on it. Under view, add view, mobile index. Then here I'm going to select a master page or layout, which is my mobile. Click add. And then we're done. So now if I go to, if I run this page, and now I do mobile index. Uh oh. Something went wrong. Oh. What did I forget? Oh, index. Okay, so I think I found the problem. Layout need to actually delete this. We're gonna copy something value from the layout, which is this guy. Let's copy this. Okay, try again. So home 
mobile index here we go so that's our new layout as you can see we're using the mobile uh, css and javascript files it doesn't look like mobile so the next thing to do is layout is is fine now the index I'll close all these guys and then we're gonna just grab something from the uh, website so go back to jquery mobile go to docs and here there's a quick starting start guide all you do is to see a new a layout how this might work just copy and paste this guy and bring it over actually this goes into the mobile layout like this now our render body we're gonna remove it and dump it right here that's your tile so and again there we go now it's looking more like a mobile site you got your header and if you want to add more controls like navigation it's really simple and this just to show this all you do is copy it now this one we can put it down here see how it looks so that was really easy to build and so this jquery mobile site is really helpful uh, to build this kind of sites really quickly let me see if you go to I like toolbars navigate the yeah navigation the navigation is really cool same thing copy and paste nothing complicated just go back to the layout <clears throat> oops don't want to move the layout and here let me see how to put it on the header Let's try this one. You see, you got different headers or navigation uh, at the top. So as you can see, it's really easy to view this uh, on your main browser. But if you have a mobile, browse to your URL and you'll see how nice it looks on your mobile. And this works on iPhones. Uh, droids and any other smartphone device so hopefully this will give you an idea how you can start your own mobile site and make sure you go through the uh, demos from jQuery mobile to see what else you can add to your site so thank you for watching